50 bucks to spend going shopping. Yay! The David Napon. Yeah, it is ugly. This night's pretty ugly. In reverse. Native Cohen. Pretty basic. Mirror Bar Bar. Issued, minted in 2000. And not minted. Printed in 2013. DI, general prefix. Uh, not worth keeping. Just worth 50 bucks. See? This Brazil banknote. A lot more character, looks better, beautiful design. Even the back is better. Yeah. Even this Taiwanese $100 looks better. Yeah. American $1, it's okay design, pretty dated though. That's alright. The other note, the other American note's are pretty crap. Uh, Indonesia, 100 rupiah, 100,000 rupiah. Yeah, looks alright. Heard they're gonna change their banknotes and coins soon anyway. Yeah, nah, it's pretty shit. And this one's better. Equivalent value, $50, $50. Singapore. That's the first Prime Minister or President, or whatever. Yeah, the reverse is a better design. But there's a cotton fibre, so it'd be a lot easier to counterfeit than polymer. Um, what else do I have here? Um, an old Bolivia, 100 Bolivianos, Peso Bolivianos. This suffered from massive inflation in the 80s. It's still a better design than Australian banknotes. Um, Ethiopia Timber designed and issued in 1976. The colour changed in 1997 when they Ethiopia and Eritrea split apart. That was to stop um, money coming from Eritrea back into Ethiopia and flooding the market. This banknote's pretty good. Not bad. And what do we have here? Oh, another one. Malaysia, 100 ringgit. I quite like this design. It's not bad. I have to say, the design beforehand was a lot better. But I don't have any here. And the last one I like to show is Thailand 20 baht. Thailand banknotes have always been pretty good. And that's all. Thank you very much.